Hi and welcome to the session. Today we will learn to draw solids on a flat surface. We will learn to draw solid shapes on a flat surface, say a paper. For that we will use two techniques. First is drawing oblique sketches and second is drawing isometric sketches. Now when we draw the solid shapes on the paper, the images are somewhat distorted so that they appear to be three dimensional. So first of all, let us start with oblique sketches. An oblique sketch of a solid gives a clear idea of how a solid looks like. The lens of the solid are not equal to the exact measurements But still we can recognize that solid. The sketch conveys all the important aspects of the appearance of the solid. So let us try to draw an oblique sketch of a cube whose measurements are 2 units by 2 units by 2 units that is each side of a cube is equal to 2 units. For this we will take a squared paper so over here we will draw the Cube. First of all, let us draw the front face of the cube, which will be like this. Now, we will draw the opposite face of this cube, which will be a square of the same size. So, we got the front face and the back face of the required cube. Now, we will join all the corresponding corners to get the cube. So, this is the required cube whose each side is 2 units. Here from this sketch it is very clear that all the lengths are not equal to the exact measurements. So to overcome this we will learn to draw an isometric sketch. So let us learn what are isometric sketches. In isometric sketches, the lengths are equal to the exact measurements of the solid. To draw isometric sketches, we use isometric dot sheets. Now let us understand what are isometric dot sheets. An isometric dot sheet is a sheet which divides the paper into small equilateral triangles made up of dots or lines. So let us draw an isometric sketch of a cube of measurements 2 units by 2 units by 2 units. So for this, first of all, we will draw the front face of the cube, which will be a square of side 2 units. Now, we will draw 4 line segments, which will be parallel to each other, starting from the 4 corners of the square of length 2 units, like this. Now, we will join the corresponding corners to get the required cube. 
Thus, this is the required cube whose each side is of length 2 units. Thus, in this session we have learnt to draw solids on a flat surface. With this, we finish this session. Hope you must have understood all the concepts. Goodbye, take care and keep smiling.